Hello there, and welcome to Riddle School 2. So obviously, this is a sequel to the last game called Riddle School. And it too, is a point and click adventure game. So with that out of the way, let's get started. And if luck, I didn't get any hate comments claiming I was copying Jacksepticeye Iron Markiplier, or someone I've never even heard of on the last one. You dropped your eyeballs. <laughs> okay, let's see. Money. I have a whole dollar. Once again, dramatic music. Cold. What's that about? Yeah, as unsuitable as it is, I do like the crazy dramatic music. That's my trombone. I left the slide all in Mrs. Sleep's room. But Smiley, she's the only one around who likes school. You know, it kind of looks like, um... I think they said his name was Zack last game. It might have changed, though. But it kind of looks like he's jiggling to the feet. <laughs> That's Zack, who is always very, very cold. I wonder why he never wears more than one sweater. Those are rainbow xylophones. I don't like them because they remind me of rainy days. That's another one. Here's my whistle for that doll you've got there. I don't actually use it anyway. Did anyone else notice that the base symbol is backwards? I think you're right. I think. I took music tech, not actual, like, music theory, so I don't know. That's an I did it trace drum set. The creator of this game probably had trouble drawing it. <laughs> Self-deprecating humor. <laughs> That's what the band director wrote yesterday to admit to us the non-musical truth. That's the band director, Mr. Oboe. He only got hired because of his name. Well, I think we've covered everything. Oh yeah, That's Smiley. She's the only one around who likes school. She's better drawn this time around, though. Well, actually, that's true of everything. Artistic evolution. But now, we do this. Here's your whistle back, Fred. Don't feel like stealing music from you at the moment. Oh. She's frowning now. <laughs> Let's see. That's Mrs. Sleep. She hasn't moved since last month. Don't we find someone out? To drag her out of the room and replace her? She's here to stay. It's kind of boring, but at least you don't have to do any work. This was a sleep computer. It was in sleep mode until someone unplugged it. <laughs> Those are insignificant posters. Don't feel blue. Look on the bright side. Isn't that interesting? She stopped at the letter Z. Okay. I think my trombone slide all could be of use. I'll bring my furry sense along, just in case. Okay, we have money and oil. Probably can't do anything there. That's the band room. That is glorious freedom. I can't get out. But the counter at this school has the keys like last time. Let's do to two. Okay, let's get to his office, grab the keys, and make my escape. Obviously, this is probably easier said than done. Unless, of course, you're a mute. Nothing in those lockers. Next way. Break for ducks, do you? I don't break for ducks. There aren't many ducks around here, and I can't drive yet. That's fair enough. Money! Maybe we just stole it out of some kid's locker, but mm, we probably need it more. Door's locked and the lights are off. The door is locked and the lights are off. Whoosh. It looks cool, but I don't think it does a thing. You need toilet paper. These things are awesome because there's soap in the water that comes out of them. 
Huh. No, you were just in the men's room. Oh, I want a cookie. Just a cookie. Nothing else. I probably won't need that. The only father's school's ever had was when Zack sneezed all over that science project. Riddle school too. Wow, the very second one? Also, I'll still have to check it out once I escape school. <laughs> There's a roll of toilet paper in that vent. There's six toilet paper in vents. I'm with you there. <laughs> I would go in and get it, but the vent cover's rusted shut. Yay! We got the vent toilet paper. Don't know what it's doing there, but we got it. The back door's unlocked, but it's blocked by a dumpster. That stinks. Well, back to you, I guess. Welcome. Oh, well, the janitor probably wants his stuff back like last time. To find my mop. I'm looking all over for it. So turning it, here's my last dime. And don't waste all the school's cheesy pencils. Okay, so we have 30, 40 cents. You still want your cookie? Well, teacher's lounge, I guess. Why are you in here? Very nice of you, but this is the teacher's lounge. Get out. Let's try it again. Are you in here? Um the teacher sent you in here. Mr. Robo, do you have a note? I didn't think so. Get out. I'm not comfortable going back in there exactly. Yeah, it's probably best. <laughs> oh, they're gone. Well, I better plug that in. Of course, I don't have enough money for a coin yet, I don't think. I need 75 cents. Yeah, that's pretty much what I figured. It's a picture of an apple. I'd rather need a real apple instead of a picture of one. It's a cobweb. I sold one of those at a garage sale for ten dollars. <laughs> coffee machine. It reminds me of my old teacher, Mrs. Coffee. She took so much for her coffee that her classroom started crumbling apart. I don't really want a cookie. But I haven't figured it out yet. Have a nice visit while you're here. And hurry back to class when you're finished. On the plus side. Get it? Yes. It's a pie chart. Called the pie chart because 3.14% of the people said pumpkin pie was their favorite. This is for Sims calculator. I can't see why he would need it, since all he does is simple addition. 1 plus 2 equals the square root of 9. That's very true. It is, actually. I think we're done in this room. Wow, this room is really green. That's my screen. Now we can't really think of anything to say that you haven't already figured out. Guacamole, 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 guacamole. That's a stool. Okay, I don't think this room has anything to do. The screen spilled coffee on that wall, destroying its surface. What kind of coffee do you guys make around here? That's not normal. <laughs> Yay. Oh, poor chub. <laughs> it's a bowling ball. 
What is it doing in here, though? That's five. Yes, that's his name. He had a scroll actually a few years ago for his vote five shirt. I'm keeping this. I think he took the key. You think? <laughs> Freedom! With cutscene. Speaking of this guy who made everything in this game, well, except for the other people who are in here, I guess. They're actually no longer called John Bro, they changed to John Chrome, and they've actually made some other stuff besides this series since, including One Night at Frumpties. But yeah, that's besides the point. Either way, this is Riddle School 2, and that's it for now. I hope to see you in the next video. So, goodbye.